Google Chrome is by far one of the world's most popular web browsers, but it's not perfect and runs into issues from time to time. My name is Yadullah. You are watching Candid.Technology and in this video we are talking about how to fix the or snap error on Google Chrome. The or snap error generally occurs when Chrome cannot load a web page due either due to internet connectivity problems or if there's something wrong in the browser. Now, the first thing to do in such cases is to check if your internet connection is working. If you're connected to Wi-Fi or Ethernet, just try opening any speed test website. I'm using fast.com. You can use either speed test or any other website or extension of your preference. Uh, as you can see, my internet connection is a little slow, but it's still working fine. So Chrome should open any website that I want and it does. Moving on, the next step is to force quit Chrome and check uh, restart the browser essentially to see if it's working. To do that, just right click on the Windows button and head over to the task manager. In here, uh, you will see Google Chrome in the app section or in the background section depending on whether the browser is actively open or not just select the browser wherever you see it click end task and make sure that there are no other chrome instances running in this list in my case there are no other chrome instances at the moment so i can restart chrome and uh, if i load any other website just dismiss this message and now if I load any other website like google.com, it should work just fine or any other website for that matter. So let's say YouTube, YouTube also works. So moving on, the next solution is to check for an update. If it's an issue within the browser, there's a good chance that the devs have already issued an update to be able to fix the error. So to do that, just click on these three dots right here scroll down and click on settings and once you're in here you can just uh, head over to about chrome and it will automatically check and update chrome to the latest version that's available as you can see i have an update pending which is downloading as we speak once this update has downloaded and chrome has restarted your error should go away Now, as I mentioned before, the or snap error also occurs because of some problems in the browser. These problems can be caused by things like corrupt data or cookies or corrupt cache files that get stored in your browser over time. Now to remove them, just click these three buttons and click the clear browsing data option. Uh, you can also use the control shift delete shortcut key for this. But if I click this, uh, this new setting opens up. And as you can see, uh, basically you can go uh, head over to the advanced section, select all in the time range and just check everything in here. So all the cached images and files, uh, autofill form data, site settings, hosted app data. Uh, you can choose to remove your passwords and sign in data as well. Uh, this generally is not the source of the problem. So if you don't want to log in again, you can skip this, but uh, it is recommended that you just wipe everything off. Autofill form data and everything, select everything, click on the clear data button, restart your browser and it should start working just fine. If clearing the browser data did not help, you can also completely reset Chrome to get rid of anything uh, that may be causing problems and start afresh. To do that, just click uh, the three vertical dots again, head over to settings. In here, uh, click on this reset settings icon and then you will see this window up here. Click on restore settings to their original defaults. This will give you a warning prompt. So it will reset Chrome settings and shortcuts, disable extensions and wipe out everything else. Just click on reset settings and you will be good to go when you relaunch the browser. Next up on the list are extensions. Now, while extensions are supposed to enhance your browsing experience, some of them can also cause problems. Uh, to access your extensions, you can either click on this extension button right here or you can head over to settings and select extensions from here. So go to extensions and then click manage extensions. Now in here, disable any extensions that you don't actively use. If you've uh, added any other extensions and this problem started happening after that, 
just go ahead and disable this slider and then keep checking after you disable every extension to see which one of them was causing the problem. Once you find it, just click the remove button to remove the extension from Chrome and you should be able to get back to browsing in no time. Another issue uh, with Chrome is that sometimes hardware acceleration can cause rendering issues with websites leading to the or snap error. To fix that, head over to this three vertical dots, click settings and then head over to system. In system, just uh, disable the use graphics acceleration when available slider. You're going to have to restart your browser for setting to change, uh, take effect. And once the browser is restarted, you should be able to get back to browsing your internet just fine. All right, uh, this is not a recommended solution, but if nothing else works, what you can do is you can run Chrome in compatibility mode. So to do that, just open the start menu, search for Chrome, uh, we're going to right click and head click on the open file location option. Once we're there, right click Google Chrome and head over to properties. In here, you need to do two things. First up, head over to the compatibility tab. Enable the run this program in compatibility mode for option and select a Windows installation from the list. So I'm just going to select Windows 8, click apply. And once you're done with it, you can go back to the shortcut bit and in the target window, go to the very end, press space, press dash two times, then type no dash sandbox and then click apply. All of these commands will be in the description below. Now restart Chrome and you should be able to use it without any problems. Last but not least, if nothing else works when it comes to fixing Chrome, you can try reinstalling the browser from scratch. To do that, right click the start menu icon and head over to installed apps. Wait for this to load up. Let's give it a second. All right, now I'm going to scroll down this list until I see Google Chrome, or you can just search for it here. So search for Chrome, here it is. Click these three buttons. Click the uninstall option. It will ask you whether you want to uninstall everything. Click the uninstall button. After Chrome is removed, head over to the Google website and download it again. Reinstall the thing and it should be working without any problems. If you like these videos, consider subscribing, give us a thumbs up, press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such content can we bring for you. If you want to know more about tech, visit our website, candid.technology, follow us on social media, follow me on Instagram or Twitter, and we'll see you in the next video.